How does a machine decide what option to take? What does technology do to our society if it becomes our society? This is uh, about privacy issues that uh, Google use, tracking of location, web search history, etc. We all use Google and we should all know the extent to which our data is getting out there. Just what's happening in China and where all of this might lead as far as Big Brother is concerned. In the future, or even now, you can decide what color eye your child will have, what their hair will look like. This could relate to a lot of different racial issues. The technology could make us better if we use it, enhancing what we try to accomplish. So the invention of things like the baby bottle, or a dishwasher, or things that were stereotypically and culturally women's work, the invention of those things allowed women more time, more space to do things like get an education, to be in the workforce. In Nigeria, they've created an alternative currency to be able to do the equivalent of small person loans. And that's benefited women-owned businesses that typically couldn't get in on the capitalist system there. And in India as well. In terms of climate change, using direct air capture to remove carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, putting sulfate particles into the atmosphere to reflect the sun back into space to reduce global warming. Artificial organs can be as simple as a hip replacement, a prosthetic leg. We have artificial retinas, we have artificial brain tissue. When it's used as a tool to help, technology is good. When it's used as a tool to define or control, would you say it's a problem?